<laughs> What's up, folks? So, welcome back to this episode of oh, and the Beast. And uh, in this episode, oh gosh, I'm gonna need some more food. All right, that's cool, lads. Anyway, um, I've got uh, a lot of building I need to complete. I'm trying to get to the top of this, so let's try and get to the top of things, eh, folks? All right, so which way are we going? Uh, not that way. We're going this way. All right, folks, so hope you've been enjoying me um, making this uh, series. It's been a lot of fun so far. Just, um, you know, put it down, um, you know, and all that business. Um, yeah. But yeah, it's been um, pretty interesting. Um, I've just been sort of chilling, getting it done. Um, and yeah, just, just making what I can with what I've got. Um, I think that's the important thing is doing what you can and... Um, Trying not to mess it up, really. I think what I can do is just take the liberty right now of um, just kind of going right around um, at a two brick height. And I think that'll be fine. Fine, dilly darn, dilly darn, darn. Stein with your phone. I know kitty. My kitty's chilling with us tonight. Yeah, and I uh, hope everyone is uh, feeling all right. You know, there's some uh, some COVIDness going around. Uh, not in my neighbourhood though, um, because I'm pretty sure even if there was. You know, my mom would probably be like getting scared and then she'd be like, hey, you know what? Um, we're gonna send COVID off to an auntie and uncle in uh, Bel Air. Um, pretty much, that's how things go these days. Moms are taking over and there's nothing you can do about it, everybody. Oh wow, that's what happens when you get that stuck button, man. Eh? All kinds of randomness. And uh, Miss of the Random, Chur Chur. Chur and the Churs. Hey. I always come up with like, you know, these ideas for like band names, and it's always like something and the something, you know? Like dumb and the ass. You know? Pretty much, um, yeah. I mean, maybe that would be like a good political band name, dumb and the asses. Because it kind of explains politics in general terms. You know? And I don't think there's much arguing with that fact, actually. Well, we've got a visitor, everybody. Hey? What you doing, eh? Coming here all green and weird. Look at that, eh? Cha cha. So, what I've done is I've, um, I've put the top bit round. Before, I've actually um, put the floor down, or put the ceiling on, whatever you want to call it. It's the floor, it's the ceiling, it's the ceiling, it's the floor, you know? Just as long as it's not the window or the wall, you know? Because we all know what happens then, eh? Hey folks, yeah, you all know what happens. There's this window and a wall, and, and then there's sweat, and anyway, I won't go any further, okay? So we'll go with that. Yeah. I think maybe sometimes I forget I might have a bit of a younger audience, which I did not intend to have. But nonetheless, sir, you're all fantastic. That's all good. You, know, you want to watch these crazy ass nonsense videos from a complete moron such as myself? Then that's up to you. I'm not going to stop you. I mean, I do click on that it's not for kids on uh, my uploads, so what you hey? What you can do about it? 
So I saw this thing, um, this kid, um, apparently he has autism, doesn't matter if he doesn't or not, really, I mean, whatever, um, and he um, built a 56,000 brick um, version of um, uh, the Titanic, which I thought was um, exceptional, frankly. He was like 11 or something, I don't know how old he was, but anyway, um, yeah, I mean, you know, I just think it's exceptional that he's gone out on a limb and he's gone and uh, decided, hey, you know, I'm going to make this gigantic um, project and it's going to rock. And he did it and he committed to it and he got there in the end, you know. Maximum kudos to his mother and, um, and himself, actually, frankly, I think it's incredible. You know, sometimes you forget that you're placing bricks and you just end up switching with bricks and that's kind of like pretty thing. Yeah. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but or whether it's even a few, it might be a few years old, you know, but whatever. Um, yeah. But I still think it's super cool that somebody's out there with that much Lego. And um, that much time on their hands, you know. He said uh, they reckon it took him 700 hours, which is super cool. 700 hours is a very long time. That's like, um, uh, I'd say, uh, roughly, there's 168 hours in a week. So I'd say that's roughly, I don't know, um, like five weeks-ish. Which is, you know, in a time period that is about five weeks roughly. Um, yeah, it might be less actually. Um, but it's not to say that it would have been all of five weeks of building. It would have been uh, probably a lot more. I'd say maybe, maybe it took him two months. Um, and you know, or maybe it took him three months. And, you know, whether he was doing it in the spare time or whether he was doing it as like a, you know, I wouldn't expect a, a, a child by any means to be sitting down for an eight hour period or even a six hour period and, and going through brick by brick and placing each single one. It's, it's a lot of commitment for anyone actually. I've, um, I mean, if you've seen some of my other stuff, I've built uh, Voltron, I've built, um, what was it, uh, Lego Saturn, I've built, um, uh, I think that's about it, I've built, oh, I've built a couple of other things, but they're not huge, um, you know, but that's the thing, is they do take, you know, vast amounts of time, the Lego Saturn, I think, took, um, was it Adam uh, Savage and his crew something like eight hours to build um, and that was between three people so you know that's an awful lot of Lego that's an awful lot of building um, it's vast commitment you know on their part yeah So yeah, I don't know, I mean, you know, if you've built something uh, before, uh, from, you know, something huge before, what have you built? Tell us in the comments below, and um, yeah, I'm going to try and build that, um, that pirate ship. So I'm not even sure which one's that. That one is, oh yeah, cooler. So there's that one, and then there's that one. 
then there's this one. That's the one I've finished before. That goes from the top to the bottom, bottom to the top, whatever you want to say. And there's that one. I need probably another one. I reckon another one going from the bottom to the top, like over here somewhere. But yeah. It's just because I don't want it looking... Uh, what I'm going to do is actually, I'm going to go further up. So yeah, just uh, cranking it really and um, yeah, trying to do the do. I think my cat's um, going a bit insane because um, usually I sit down and I give her lots of hats and we just chill um, and that's pretty much that. But um, on this fine evening I am needing to record a bunch of stuff and there's nothing wrong with that at all, you know? So I'm thinking of going up um actually i should do it with these three and just um create three large peaks um and then i think yeah rather than have them at uh, the uh, the sort of um murder hole top just have a um have a large peak I might do that over here as well actually and just bring that up and then um, and put a peak on the top of it same with these these other three but anyway I really need to go and get some more food and some more brick um, and yeah so hopefully it won't be too bad going down we'll see how it goes oh there's a guy already Looks like I'm just going to have to go with it. We're going to just uh, jump right in. Nope. He's probably going to try and kill me. Wicked. And this guy. Okay, 
maybe I can coax them outside and get them to die or something. Oh, here we go, here we go. Catch on fire, motherfucker. Catch on fire. Uh. Fucking don't change! Fucking spastic fucking garbage. So while I was killing the, zomb the baby zombie, the, um, the fucking controller fucked out on me. Who cares? Shit happens. Whatever. Ended up dying. That's bad. Come on, you useless cunt. Come on, we haven't got all day. It's nice, you know, we get some spawning action going on, but you know, at the end of the day, I kind of don't give a shit, you know. Can we stop fucking me around? I'm just trying to kill baby zombies, you know? Shit happens, whatever. They're down? Out the out, yeah. Jeez, man. Alright. Alright, well that's been enough harassment for one day. I'm gonna say thank you all very much for watching. You all have been fantastic. You can like and subscribe and follow me on Facebook and Twitter and TikTok and Instagram. I'm gonna get to bed. I'll see you later. Bye.